The Australian Air Force cadets have been a large part of the community since it was founded as the Air Training Corps on the 11th of July 1941 as a recruiting and training apparatus for the Royal Australian Air Force in World War II. However, with the end of the war in 1945, the need for raw recruits was over. Thus, the Air Training Corps took on a new role as a community organisation devoted to developing an interest in aviation in youths and better equipping them for community life by instilling highly regarded and useful skills and values. However, all this would be impossible without the dedicated support of the community, which still continues to this day. This support is provided by parent volunteers and individual squadron staff members who are the keystone to the development, growth and contributions of the Australian Air Force cadets within the wider Logan community due to the coordination, leadership and support that they provide to the cadets. These parents, ex-servicemen and women, community leaders and those who just wanted to help volunteer their time and expertise to act as Australian Air Force cadets staff. Without these dedicated men and women, the Australian Air Force cadets would not exist and the community would have lost a great organisation. Through their actions, the volunteers and staff have been a crucial factor in the establishment and development of Australian Air Force Cadet Squadrons within the wider Logan community and Australia itself. In the present day, the Air Training Corps has changed its name to the Australian Air Force Cadets to better fit with the changes that have occurred in the community and the organisation's purpose and role. The Australian Air Force Cadets is still a recruiting tool for the Royal Australian Air Force, but it also aims to instill skills and values to the cadets for their lives in the wider community. According to the 3rd edition Service Knowledge Instructor Notes for the induction stage of training, these skills and values include fostering initiative, leadership, discipline, loyalty and developing good character and good citizenship skills in the widest sense. This is encouraged by the parent volunteers and squadron staff members who provide coordination, leadership and support to the cadets themselves in almost all activities that the Australian Air Force cadets organise and participate in from marches and services to weekly parade nights and camps, bivouacs and promotion courses. Parental volunteers and squadron staff come from all walks of life. There is no set criteria on what skills and values are required, and so anybody from any background can become involved in the Australian Air Force cadets. Generally, it is those parents who have or have had children in the cadets who have volunteered their time, effort, skills and values. However, a large number of ex-military personnel have also volunteered because they want to provide those in the community with the opportunity to develop good community skills and values as taught to them by the military. There are many reasons that a volunteer may have for joining the Australian Air Force cadets, but they all revolve around putting something back into their community by teaching the children of it excellent skills and values that will be incredibly useful to them in their own communities later on in life. These dedicated and highly valued members of the community are vitally important to the Australian Air Force cadets as they are the keystone to the whole organisation because of the coordination, leadership and support that they provide to the cadets. Through the crucial actions of the parent and staff volunteers, the Australian Air Force cadets can provide the community with support for returned and ex-servicemen by marching at parades such as Anzac Day, Korean Veterans Day, Vietnam Veterans Days, acting as catafalque parties for Remembrance Day services and Logan City Royal Australian Air Force Association services, and also by showing the uniform in support of the ex-servicemen. The Australian Air Force cadets also directly contribute to, com to the community by providing the cadets themselves with highly regarded and useful skills and values that are essential in their later lives in the communities, such as initiative, leadership, discipline, loyalty, good characteristics and good citizenship skills in the widest sense. The parent and staff volunteers are the keystone to the Australian Air Force cadets' contribution to the community because without these vital volunteers, the Australian Air Force cadets would not be able to provide the cadets with the values and skills that are instrumental in the cadets' later life in the community. The cadets would also be unable to contribute their services to the community because the volunteers are essential in the coordination, leadership and support of the cadets. Without the crucial work provided by staff and parent volunteers, there would be no Australian Air Force cadets. This is verified by the words of Flight Lieutenant Ken Brandis, who has been a staff volunteer with the Australian Air Force cadets for over 40 years, the last three of which he has spent at 214 Squadron, located at Park Ridge. 
basically without the staff, without the parents, of course, we don't have any cadets. Um, they all combine then to support the cadet activities, so wherever the cadets go, the parents are there, the staff are there, and the staff from all their various backgrounds, um, mixing with, say, the community. We've done a lot of um, things with the local local council, what is the Logan Council, and helping out the sub-branch and the RAF Association. So the, uh, without the, as I said, without those people as leaders, we, we can't um, do anything, that's for sure. Although the Australian Air Force Cadets is an organisation that focuses on developing an interest in aviation in youths and better equipping them for community life through the teaching of highly regarded and useful skills and values, it is all heavily dependent on one underpinning factor. This is that the parental volunteers and individual squadron staff members are the keystone to the development, growth and contributions of the Australian Air Force Cadets within the wider Logan community because of the contribution, leadership and support that they provide to the cadets. Without these hardworking members of the community, the Australian Air Force Cadets would not exist, nor would it be able to provide the community with the services that it does today.